The Gathering Tree made a decision today to close down their nightly drop-in center called The Tree to build these small houses for homeless people as a permanent solution. Where we no longer look at people holding a sign on the corner of our streets. Nate Schluter with Eden Village says the goal of the Eden Village program is to have 30 chronically homeless people move in by Christmas Eve. Somebody that's chronically homeless has had multiple long-term episodes of homelessness over the last three years or they've been homeless for a year or longer. Um, our rule is that they needed to be homeless for a year or longer in Springfield. Volunteers spent the past few months trying to get the houses finished in time. I helped with planting a lot of the gardens and we've just done a lot of cleaning over the times. Connor Ewins and Maya Fabro tell me why they chose to volunteer here. The residents that I've met so far, they're all amazing and they're so, so sweet and I just love getting to help them out in whatever way I can. It's super impactful, especially being that I'm from Springfield and I've always seen people out um, on the streets and it's like just, I live in the North side and I just I won't, doing this is phenomenal like knowing that people are going to be able to live in these extremely nice homes. Schluter says they will continue building Eden villages until every homeless person has somewhere to sleep. That's what this month is all about. It's homeless awareness month but it's about what can we do as individuals um, to end homelessness and so people can come they can donate here they can volunteer here we need up to a thousand different individual volunteers 